What is up guys, this is Nick. We are back on BDO. We are going to be continuing our Nova here. We're going to be doing kills at Hex Sanctuary today. We're gonna get the, um, we're gonna get this 300 kills for the Witch's Earrings. It's not a huge reward, but I think we might as well do it. I did complete a couple of the kills that we needed. Let's go ahead and open up this mysterious treasure, because why not? It's nothing big, but who knows? A white plume, chamfering. Is that worth? Is that worth anything? It can't be, or it would have done that like motion where they raise their fist. But uh, let's see. 160k increases. Um, okay, not bad. We'll take the little bit of money. But yes, we're gonna clear out. We need to get 270. This is not my favorite area. Um, I usually come here and get out as soon as possible. I know it's a good place to farm because you can get the witch's earrings. And for uh, at this point of the game, it's a good place to farm because you can get the witch's earrings. They're 2 million a pop, but if you upgrade them, obviously you can get a lot more. The drop rate on them is not too hot, but we'll see. I don't think we'll get the drop rate, but we get the automatic one for killing 300. So that's what we're what we're shooting for i uh, fingers crossed i have my fingers crossed on the video recording today if there's any audio desync with the face cam i'm sorry i'm gonna have to work on that um it's just i don't know what it's happening i run a test before i record anything so even like those short like three minute interruptions i do a practice recording to see if the um audio is gonna desync um allergy season here <clears throat> And, but my point is, is I do the, the test to make sure that it's all good. And then I record the video and then it's a little desynced. And I'm like, well, what the heck changed from when I clicked start recording to, to not re to like stop recording the next one. So I don't know. I'm hoping I'll get it figured out here. I had, it was an issue where it would desync every day. Every day I would open my... OBS, it would be desynced to a different, like, um, milliseconds off. Because I have, like, a, I have to have a millisecond delay on it because the face cam is, like, way ahead of... The voice and the face cam are way ahead of my PVR. My PVR is, like, like a thousand milliseconds behind them. So it has to have that little offset, but it creates issues, I think, so... I should probably... <clears throat> When I, I'm going to get a new computer here this summer, I think. I should probably just get an internal Elgato, because then I don't think I'll need the massive delay on it. The P, I mean, the PVR is old. It's, um, I want to say it's like six years old or something like that. It's really old. And so I probably am I'm due for an upgrade, so I should probably get the Elgato that's built in. Or the, I mean, any of the options that... I, I've never been a gigantic fan of the Elgato, but it's kind of the the gold standard of what everybody gets, so probably we'll just end up getting that. But yeah, I don't know why it's desyncing like it is. Can I not? Why is that not breakable? It just creates this weird, like, poop around the thing. Okay. But yeah, so I gotta figure gotta figure that out. That's a big need, because we, obviously we don't want, we don't want desync videos. But I've got a little bit of time. I'm going to record today's videos. Um, we're going to have a chunk. You're going to see me in this this, uh, this shirt a decent amount over the next like few days because i got to get a bunch recorded today because I can't record tomorrow and I can't record on... I probably can record like just the update for BDO on Wednesday and that's about it. So I have to, I have to record this morning. I got up like mad early this morning for... Well, I wanted to check tennis, and then I was like, "Yep, we're up, so let's let's just let's just get to record." Okay. I will try. Hopefully, I'll remember to go back in and mute that sneeze. It'll you'll see it on like the the camera, but I'll do my best to remember to go back and mute it. But okay, enough about like upcoming stuff. You guys know I love I love a good ramble. I love a good ramble, but. 
right now on Nova, we're at 51. I at least want to get her... I don't know. We're going to get to Awakening, and then I'm going to do a farm video. And from there, I'm going to decide if Nova is good enough for me to continue playing on, or if I'm going to switch it up to a different character. I mean, there's a fairly good chance that I switch it up. Okay, this is the Invincible Skeleton walking back to his place, but still attacking me, so great. But yeah, there's a decent chance that I scrap it. I don't know with all the MMOs coming out if I want to have two characters going or if I just want to focus on my Sork. So I'll have to figure all that out. But we got a handful of Nova still to go because I got to get her to 56. And obviously this episode not going to be heavy progression. This is more about, well, let's just take the time, kill some skeletons, have some fun. We haven't farmed on this at all. It's been a hard push. And this isn't even really a farm. I mean, this is... This is like a light grind. Farming to me is not like 30, 20 minutes, which is what this is going to be. Maybe it'll be a little bit longer, but we're already halfway there. I already had a few done because I I started a video and I was like, you know what? Let me check if the... Because I, I hadn't tested the audio desync and I was like, yep, this is desync. So, yeah, we had a few kills under our belts to start with. I think we had like 35 or something like that. So, we had a little bit. Okay, there's that. So we've got 146 to go. But we haven't been, like, straight grinding through something in a while. I've just been showing you, like, quick, oh, hey, we need to kill 80 of these enemies, or we need to kill this boss, so here's this video. I thought it would be a little bit different. We gotta, we gotta mix it up a little, keep you on your toes just, just, a, just a wee bit on what's gonna be the content for the week. But yeah, that's the real reason I'm thinking about just either playing Sork or playing Nova. We might stick with Nova for a while and not have any Sork episodes, but like this week, it's going to turn out weird because t today's going to be a no- or yeah, well, when you see this, Tuesday or whatever, it's going to be a Nova episode, but then there's not a chance for a Nova episode until like the following week because I'm doing all that- uh, PSO2 New Genesis beta content, so who knows what on earth we're gonna do. It'll give me a chance. I'll probably get this character to, like, 53 or something like that. I'll probably finish up all of this and get to Valencia, which we all know I hate with a burning passion. I hate that desert area with, like, if you can... If there's one part in this game that I hate more than anything else, it's the desert. But my favorite farm spot is over there, so it's like, you know... Uh, Bashim's base is like my favorite sp I, I know it's not like the most efficient I don't know why my character is not moving I was like I was stuck in mud there but I know it's like not one of the better like farm spots overall but I really like it I like the rotation that I made and all that different stuff so I just like it it's one of my favorite spots but it's not really in the desert but it's over there by Altanova and all of that different stuff so I don't know how you want to count that. You could count it as part of the desert, but it's really not, because you can see, you can mark a quick path there and whatnot. So it's not really desert, but it wouldn't be there without the desert content. So it's kind of a kind of a catch twenty two. But yes, that that will weigh heavily because oh my gosh, I just finished all that content on the sword. And, oh my gosh, it was painful. I know we still have, we have the quarry, we have a couple of spots still to go. And I will probably um, farm over there at the, I don't even remember what it's called, the Abandoned Iron Mine, not the quarry, the Abandoned Iron Mine, but it's like a quarry. Um, I'll probably farm over there a fair amount because I think it's probably worth it to farm. I don't really need a Sula set. I mean, we could get the upgrade materials. That wouldn't be terrible provision, but I don't actually need to farm there. Because usually you farm there, you want to get a Sula set, but I don't need Sula set, so... It'll be a little bit more focused on leveling. It's my favorite... It's the best place to level to get to Awakening, in my opinion. You can do it. You can go from 55 to 56, especially with, like a couple of XP scrolls, 
you can go there in like 45 minutes. I mean, it's, it's nothing ridiculous. You get like 25, per, you get like 5% per rotation, and each rotation takes like two minutes. I like timed it out once because I was interested. Because I've gotten a couple characters other than my, like the archer. What do we get? I'll take a look here real quick. After we slam him, okay, go back up here on the hill. Um, no, they're gonna go. Ah, oh, you guys just couldn't leave me alone. You just couldn't, you couldn't leave me alone so I could take a look at what we've got to 56. Okay. Let's see here. Go disconnect. So, Sork, Ninja, whatever that character is that I can't hit. What is that? Is that, I don't even know what that is. Is that Maywa? I'm not even, I don't even know what character Ordinalasana is. I think it's Maywa, but I could be wrong. But that's, that's 3 to 56. I think when I did the Archer, I timed it because I was like, hey, this is actually fairly quick. And I think I had, I didn't have any XP scrolls or anything like that on the Archer. It was just like 45 minutes straight up for him. So, yeah, I, I will definitely, we'll have, I'll probably save the 600% scrolls for that. And then we can knock it out in like one video, 55 to 56 in one video. I think maybe it's two hours. It might be two hours. I think it's two hours. I think I'm I'm remembering wrong. I think it's two hours. And I think it took me 45 minutes on that. Whatever Ordinal Asana is. I don't even remember what class she is. Um, whatever class she is, she's... Um, um, she took 45 minutes, I think, because I had scrolls. I think that's what it is. I think that's the 45 minutes that I'm remembering. But yeah, we should, with a 600% XP scroll for an hour, should be able to clean that up in one sitting. I mean, one video, not even, like, one sitting. That should clean up, like, mega fast. Okay, my, I just whipped all the it. I thought they were gonna, like, wander over in front of my strikes, and I was like, you yeah, know, just throw down a predictive strike, but that's, they, they didn't. These guys are so slow at following you. Okay, we're close. We got 23 more to go. Actually, this went a lot quicker than I thought. Because we're only like 13 minutes in. I thought it'd take me like 20 minutes to finish. So, we'll pro I'll go over and run and we'll figure out something else to end this. I think there's the boss. There's the boss coming up. So, that's what we'll do to end this video off. We'll go back and get our earrings and then I will cut ahead to the boss. I don't even know... Oh... Uh, I didn't even do the main quest yet. We were just like, yeah, let's go slaughter everything. I saw that. I saw that optional quest for the for the for the earrings, and I was like, yeah, screw everything else. I don't matter. We did go up like thirty percent, so that's good. I want to get as much as I can towards it without having to um, farm. I think it's a little bit easier now than it used to be. Why did the, those two just eight? Hardcore eight. Okay, last one right here. And then I gotta figure out what the main story is, because I obviously I didn't finish that up. So there's the witch's earrings. You can kill 700 now um, to get another witch's earrings. 700's a little much. Let's go see about the main quest. Let's get up here and check on that. 700 is a lot. I mean, if you were going to farm this, it's it's not a lot because that was 12 minutes to kill like 250. So it, it'd take you like a half hour. Okay, I don't know what it... What does it want me to investigate here? Investigate the surroundings of the hut in the depths of... Okay. I'm going to take my free experience here for all these guys that clustered up for me. Okay. Let's come up here. I think... Yeah, I think it's this thing. I think this is the main story quest person. <gasps> Almost just ran off the edge. Almost just ran off the edge. <laughs> okay, can stuff stop? Okay, can you guys stop following me? Seriously. Okay, and kill you. Okay, we... No, we're not good. And I probably just aggroed a bunch more by doing that. Not what I wanted to do. Because they'll just keep interrupting me. I gotta kill them. Okay, I think I think that should be good. I'm not sure if he gives you a kill quest or if it's... Yeah, he gives you a kill quest for the skeleton. So I probably should have found this guy first. 
Because now he wants you to kill 45 enemies at Hex Sanctuary. So we can do that. We've been killing 300. Yeah, I kind of forgot that that was how this worked. I forgot he was up there, that you had to go find him. I was like, oh yeah, we already got the kill quest, we'll finish it all out, but it was actually just a repeatable one. That... So, that, that, that's not how it worked. That's not how it worked, but that's fine. 45 extra kills, no biggie. I need to work on skills, because I think we have a whole heck of a lot of skill points, and a whole lot of nothing that I've done to upgrade my skills. Because if I will kill that guy and then I want to try to wait for the things to respawn anyway, because this is the best area to get a lot of kills. Okay, so if I go, what's it under? Character, skill. See, I have 324 skill points. I should probably figure out something to upgrade. I just haven't upgraded anything. Um, I kind of want to just get to Awakening and then we'll mess with the skills, but... I definitely need to upgrade skills because I don't even have stuff some stuff unlocked to do combos, so I definitely need I definitely am in dire need. If I didn't have gear that was like OP for like where I'm at, I would definitely want to do it now. But we have this gear, it's way too high level for this part of the game. So I don't think we need to force learning skills now when I can just wait. Because if I'm only gonna play in the awakening form which is the goal right now there's no point because i'll just have to reset anyway to have skill points for the awakening stuff that i want to equip so yeah that's why i haven't really the gameplay style hasn't changed it's mostly this ltrt combo that slams down because i just it's the best thing we got right now because i haven't unlocked any skills so it's kind of like you know there's no other option i'm gonna try to do this quick Okay, come on, man. Talk to me. I think it should be... Is it boss quest now? No, another witness. Hmm. I thought it was the boss. Visit Jansen at Hex Sanctuary. Okay, I'm gonna cut ahead here to the boss. I think it, it kind of ends this portion of the game. And so I think that'll be a good point to call it an episode. But yes, let me get to the lady, um, the Hex Sanctuary boss. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so for some reason, it desynced, so hopefully we're good for this final part against the Witch. It wasn't too bad, it was just like a half second off, but still not the quality that I want. But unfortunately, with Black Desert, there's no reloading a save, so we're gonna have it be how it is. I mean, if you just watch the gameplay, ignore the face cam, it, the voice is all fine and whatnot, but yes. Time to fight Hex Marie. It took a while to find Jansen's crap, so... Yeah, we are... We, ha we did get a few, a fair amount of kills. I've been going the other ways recently in... The, well, not recently, but the, the other ways in the more recent playthroughs. They're not, like, recent in time, but I mean, like... We haven't been fighting Hex Marie a lot. That's, like, the first time I fought Hex... I can remember fighting Hex Marie in a while. Maybe I'm just all, like, lost and I'm an idiot, but... I feel like that's the first time in the series that we killed Hex Marie. So we got to talk to Nella in Kalarosha. And then I believe... What's our... I don't actually know what our next... I want to see here. Get the commissions back from Jensen. I want to say... So we're over here. Is our next stop... Our next stop's not down here because this is Kama. Um, is it... Is it over to abandon? Are we back? Are we over to abandon Iron Mine after this? I don't know. I'll figure it out. We'll come back with the next episode. I know that was like a short re thing because we kill it so fast, but I'll figure out where we're going and uh, I'll get the next episode all planned out. Hopefully, I'll get the audio issues all fixed. I don't know what's happening. It desynced. It just doesn't make any sense. It's almost like if the video's too long, it desyncs out, which I could remedy that, but I also, you know, it's kind of annoying to 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 fix that by having to cut videos like it, like in the middle of like playing, I'm like, "Okay, we'll go make a cut here." That's just stupid, but we'll see how it we'll see how it works and we'll we'll I'll get it figured out. I mean, it it, it it's got to be a simple issue. I fixed the last one that was far worse. 
we'll get this one fixed. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't. Appreciate y'all watching, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. We'll have Idol BDO update. No, wait, tomorrow's Tuesday. Tomorrow we'll have PSO2. Um, continuing our kind of get into it before a new Genesis. Wednesday, Idol GOG and um, uh, BDO update. Thursday, we will have a another um, PSO2. And then I'll try to, on Friday, maybe early, I'll get a Sork video out. I don't know. If not, that Sork video might come out on Saturday. I won't, I won't go... I won't go Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then potentially Monday without BDO, so we'll probably just have a huge upload day on, like, Saturday or something like that, and I'll have a Sork video then. But that's going to do it, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop it a big old like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. Once again, I appreciate you all watching. Um, I've really been enjoying coming back to make videos. I'll do a more heartfelt, like, thank you <laughs> in a different video, but just saying thank you, guys, that watched the end. So I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Cause when it's all over.